Praise the living God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory, 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 hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Hallelujah to Master Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah to Master Jesus. We bless the name of the Lord. Our God is good. Our Savior is good, everlasting Father, everlasting God, awesome daddy, marvelous daddy, great daddy. There's many people, beloved, there is many people that went to bed last night and they didn't wake up this morning. It's not because you and I, we are better than them that make, uh, make us to wake up this morning. It's the grace of the Lord Almighty. We bless the name of the Lord. We bless the name of the Lord. Our God is good. Our God is kind. Our God is lovely. We bless the name of the Lord for waking you and I up to see another blessed for day. We bless the name of the Lord. He's worthy. He's worthy. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless God. We bless Savior. We bless our Savior. We bless our Redeemer. We bless our God. Our God is good. Mighty Savior. Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus, hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. We have, I would like to have a word of prayer in Jesus' name, amen. Oh, Heavenly Father, the King of kings, the Lord of Lord, the Asians of the Father, you are worthy. You are mighty, you are excellent, you are wonderful, mighty God that do mighty things. Father God, there is no other God like you. There is no other God to compare to you at the most high God. Father God, I thank you, mighty God, for your waking me up, for your waking my family up, for your waking each and every one of your sons and your daughter up, oh my God. And I thank you for humanity. I thank you for the body of Christ. Thank you for my family, sir family members, oh Lord, and bless your holy name, I exalt your name, Father, you are worthy. Father, thank you, Lord, oh Son, that is the God of mercy. Father, in any way that sin against you, in any way that we have sin against you, Father, I ask for your mercy in Jesus' name. I cover myself, cover each and every one of us with the blood of Jesus Christ. When I hand over this program unto your pants, oh my God, I pray with um, I hand over this program unto your mighty hand, Father God, Jesus Christ, see Jesus Christ, that he, 2,000 years ago, he see the same Jesus, he see healing, Father God, I thank you. All your sons and your daughter that you will hear today, Father, and bless your name. I exalt your name in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, be with my mouth, oh my God, and not my voice, and not my uh, not my lips, oh my God, for your glory in the name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit of God, fill me afresh in Jesus' name. Spirit, the Spirit of the living God, fill me afresh. I welcome you, come and have your way here, all your sons and your daughter in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I'm gonna thank you. Any power, any spirit, any personality that <coughs> want to attack. And I don't want to leave your children. Oh, Lord Jesus Christ, Almighty God, Father, bound them and cast them out of your children's life in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, hear your children in the name of Jesus Christ. Let your healing rain shower upon your sons and your daughter. Hear your sons and your daughter, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, you are worthy. Father, you are mighty. Father, God, you are excellent. Father, God, you are marvelous. Father, take all the glory. And I take all the honor. Father, take all the praise. I did marvel Jehovah. Excellent Jehovah, thank you, Lord. All powers belong to you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, I have prayed. Amen and amen. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. <coughs> we bless the name of the Lord. Our God is good. Our God is kind. We bless His holy name in Jesus' name. I would like to sing to the glory of God. If you know the song, just join me. Let us worship our Maker, our lovely Daddy, God, and Daddy that loves us so much that never leave us and forsake us. We love Him. He loves us for us. Amen. Your name is lifted up above all the name. Your name is lifted up above all the name. Oh, your name is lifted up above all the name. Your name is lifted up above all the name. Your name is lifted up above all the name. Your name is lifted up above all the name. 
Oh, your name is lifted high above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted high above the name. Your name is lifted high above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted high above the name. Your name is lifted high above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted high above the name. Your name is lifted high above the name. Your name is lifted high above the name. Your name is lifted high above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted high above the name. Your name is lifted high above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted high above the name. Your name is lifted high above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted. I above the name. My name is lifted. I above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted. I above the name. Your name is lifted. I above the name. Your name is lifted. I above the name. Your name is lifted die above the name. Your name is lifted die above the name. My name is lifted die above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted die above the name. Your name is lifted die above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted die above the name. Lifted I above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted I above the name. Oh, your name is lifted I above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted I above the name. Your name is lifted I above the name, Lord. Your name is lifted I above the name. Lift your name, my Lord. I 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 lift your name, my Lord. We 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 lift your name. My Lord, we lift your name, my Lord. We lift your name, my Lord. Shout hallelujah, hallelujah, shout hallelujah, hallelujah, shout hallelujah, hallelujah, shout hallelujah, 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 shout 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 Name, my yellow. We lift your 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 name, my yellow. Oh, shut a little. Hallelujah, 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 shut a little. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, shout hallelujah, 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 hallelujah, lift your name, my Lord, we 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 lift your name, my yellow. 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 Ancient of this, yes, Lord. I saw that she I saw the shiwa, Panaga ye we never chance. Oh, a chance of the is. I saw the shiwa, I saw the shiwa, Father God, you we never chance. A chance of this, yes, Lord. I saw the shiwa. I saw the shiwa, 
Hanaga ye we never change. Oh, yes, of days. I saw that you are Lord. I saw that you are Father God. Ye we never change. Oh, yes, of days. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I saw that she was Lord. I saw that she was Papa Gaya. We never change. Oh, a chance of this. I saw that she was Lord. I saw that she was Father God. You will never change. A chance of this. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I saw that you are. I saw that you are. Father God, you will never change. Oh, yes, yes, of this. I saw that you are alone. I saw that you are Father God, you will never change. Ancient of this, yes, my Father, my Lord. I saw that you are. I saw that you are Papa God, you will never change. Oh, ancient of this, I saw that you are Lord. I saw that you are Father God, you will never change. It's chance of this. Hallelujah. I saw that you are daddy. I saw that you are Father God, you will never change. Oh, it's chance of this. I saw that you are Lord. I saw that you are Father God, you will never change. Amen. Praise the living God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. We bless the name of the Lord. This is the day that the Lord has made. You and I will rejoice and be glad in it. We bless the name of the Lord. We thank God for God. We bless his holy name for waking us up to see our beloved ones, to see our neighbors, to see our surroundings. We bless the name of the Lord. We thank God for his mercy. We thank God for his compassion. We thank God for his provision. We thank God for his protection. Our God is good. Our lovely daddy, he is so, a great God. Almighty God, we bless his holy name in Jesus' name. Amen. I welcome you all in the name of Jesus Christ, my brothers, my beloved bro my beloved sisters and brothers, my mommies, my daddies in the house. May the Lord bless all of you in the name of Jesus Christ for tuning in, for, for, turning, for tuning in, for, for joining. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. We bless God for blessing us. Amen. Hallelujah. Papa God has sent me, Lord Jesus, has sent me to come and pray for you, my brothers, my sisters, wherever you are. Has sent me to come and pray for you. Maybe you are in the hospital, you are home, you are sick. He sent me to come and pray for you. Jesus Christ, he is. Jesus Christ that hit 2,000 years ago is still the same Jesus. He's still doing the same business. Our Lord Jesus, he loves his children so much. He loves us so much. He's seeing you sick there. He's seeing you crying every night, every day. You cannot sleep. You turn to the, on your right, on your left. You can't sleep because of the pain is too much. He touches him. He sent me to come and pray for you. Please, all you have to do, you don't have to pay for it, it's free. Your healing is free. It's just what you have to do, release your faith. Because our God is the God of faith. The word of the Lord said, without faith, you and I cannot please him. Without faith, we cannot receive from him. He is the God of faith. Before you will receive from me, you must have faith. Even though the faith is tiny, you must release that your faith to receive from him. Praise Master Jesus. The Lord Jesus Christ that he 2,000 years ago, all those ones, all those people that came to him 
asked him to heal them. All of them, they had faith. And they went home healed. They came with sickness. They left with good health. Praise Master Jesus. As he has sent me to you right now, in your bedroom where you are right now, you are sitting or you are lying there in the hospital at home. All you have to do, trust in him. He's a compassionate God that loves his children so much. He cares for you. He cares for me. Please don't say, because I have seen it, we not hear me. Because I don't know this Jesus, it will not hear me. No. It's his goodness that will bring you to repentance. It's his goodness that will make you to, you want to know him more. You want to know who is this Jesus? Who is this Jesus that sent a daughter to come and pray for me and I'm healed? I want to know this Jesus. You will like to dip, yeah, go deeper and live for him. Is a lovely Jesus. King of glory, ancients of this. The God that cares for his children, compassionate God. He wants to hear you. I will use the word of the Lord to encourage you, my brothers, my sisters, my mommy, my daddies in the hospital at home that's sick right now. Please. If you yourself have already give, given up of yourself because of this sickness, you think in this sickness you will not live. No, you will live. You shall not die, but live and declare the words of the Lord. You will live by the grace of the Lord to your full age in the name of Jesus Christ. That sickness will not take your life. You will live in the name of Jesus Christ. As what our Lord Jesus says, as what our God said in his word, by the stress of Jesus Christ, you are now, we are here. You are here, beloved. All you have to do, believe and trust in him. Don't doubt, because when you doubt, you will not receive from him. When you doubt, you don't believe it, you will not receive from me half faith. Please don't say I'm not a Christian. He wants to hear you. He is your maker. He creates you from, your, from his own image after his likeness. Please, he wants to hear you. I will read the word of the Lord to encourage you. He that did it by that man and by then, he see the same Jesus. The man was, was his hand was with us. Nobody could nobody hate this man. But this man, he heard about Jesus. And Jesus, miraculous God, he hid his son. Our God is a God of miracles. I want you to receive your miracles from Almighty God today. Don't let your miracle pass you by. Please. Lord Jesus loves you. Lord Jesus cares for you. He wants you to be well. He wants you to stand up and do what you couldn't do before. He wants you to do what you couldn't do before for many days, for many weeks, for many months, for many years. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. I will read the word of the Lord to encourage you then. We continue from there, and then I will pray for you in Jesus' name. Amen. The book of Mark. Hallelujah. The book of Mark 3. Want you. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. I read in Jesus' name. The book of Mark. Three, one to five. And he entered again into the synagogue. And there was a man there which had a withered hand. And they watched him whether he would heed him on the Sabbath day, that they might accuse him. And he said unto the man which had the wither hand, stand forth. And he said unto them, Is it lawful to do good on the Sabbath days, or to do evil, to save life, or to kill? But they had their peace. 
And uh, when he had uh, looked around about on uh, them uh, with uh, anger, be grief for the hardness of uh, their hearts. He said unto the man, stretch uh, forth thy hand. And uh, he stretched it out. And uh, his uh, hand was uh, restored whole as the other. Praise Master Jesus, you see? Praise Master Jesus. The people, those people that were there that want to, to accuse our Lord Jesus. The people couldn't be able to help this man for how many days? I don't know how many days, how many weeks, how many years this man had the, the, the problem of uh, his hand was withered. They were not there. They were, none of them even feel concerned for this man. That means they were happy when this man was sick. None of them even said, okay, let me pray for you. No. And the son Jesus came to the synagogue. And they knew that Jesus, anywhere Jesus goes, he's doing good. They, know, they, they knew that uh, Jesus, as he came to this synagogue, he will do something good. Because he's a God of blessing. They knew all their mind, okay, we will see what he wants to do. We know that he's a God, he's a, he's a, he's a, he's a, and he, uh, all the places that he went, he's doing good. We hope he's not going to do, do, this, uh, do good in this Sabbath day. Because we, 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 my, me, me, me. That is what they were thinking. They didn't even care for somebody else that passing through that pain, that horrible pain. No, they're concerned about the Sabbath. Ah, oh, they want, they want to accuse the Lord Jesus. Why should he hear on the Sabbath day? I thank God for Jesus. Father Lord Jesus saw their hardness, their wicked heart. Father Lord Jesus asked them questions, but they, none of them answered. None of them stood, stood up and they answered the question. When the Lord Almighty God, Jesus, compassionate God, asked them, he saw that he knows their heart, he knows what is in their heart, what they want to do, they want to accuse him because he wants to do good. Everywhere he went, he did good. Everywhere he went, he do good. They know that he will do good again today, where we see. Not this Sabbath. This is a holy day. You don't do this. So when he asks them question, the, the moment he asked them question, all of them were sealed. Speechless. Father Lord Jesus Christ asked them, is it good? Is it good for somebody to do good? On the Sabbath day? Or is it good for somebody to do evil on the Sabbath day? Is it good to save life on the Sabbath day? Or is it good to kill on the Sabbath day? Kill life on the Sabbath day? That you cut a Sabbath day on your head? That because of Sabbath you don't want to do good to somebody else? That you see somebody is dying, you don't care for that person? Lord Jesus, you can see the love that he has for his children. Why I'm using this word to encourage you, the love, the compassion Lord Jesus Christ has for children. Lord Jesus Christ didn't say, because it's a Sabbath day, I will not hear this man. Because he knew the pain this man is passing through. Now Jesus, he, this man, he told him, stand up. And the man stood up. He said, stretch, off your, stretch out of your, of, your, of your hand. And he did. And he was restored. His hand was restored whole. He wants to do the same to you. The enemy that doesn't want you to, to get well. Can be minister to you right now. Minister to your mind. Don't listen. 
God will not hear you. You have done so much uh, evil. You have done so much wickedness. God will not hear you. Please don't listen to him. He's a liar. He's a liar. It's not every sickness that comes from because you have seen. The enemy is the one the author of sickness. The Satan is the author of sickness. But God wants to hear you. Don't let him lie to you not to release your faith, not to believe. Don't let him see your, 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 your healing. Lord Jesus Christ, I have compassion to this, uh, to this man. Is still, still Lord Jesus. Is still the same Jesus Christ. Please. Please. Release your faith. Even though your faith is very uh, uh, tiny, as the word of the Lord says, Lord Jesus says, even though your, your faith is tiny, it's little like the mustard seed. If you say to this mountain, be that removed, shall be removed. Please believe and receive from him. You will stand up by the grace of God. You will be where you will be whole by the grace of God. And you go out there and testify what Lord Jesus Christ has done for you. You will tell the one you can able to tell Jesus sent her daughter, sent his daughter to come and pray for me. Jesus sent her daughter to come and pray for me. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Just believe and receive your healing. Praise Master Jesus. I will sing to the glory of God after singing. I will sit up to you before we pray for you. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. We bless the name of the Lord. Amen. Do something in your name, oh Lord. Lord, do something in your name, oh Lord. Lord, do something in your name, oh Lord. Today, Father God, do something in your name, oh Lord. Jehovah, do something in your name, oh Lord. Do something in your name, oh Lord. Today, do something in your name, oh Lord. Do something in your name, oh Lord. Do something in your name, oh Lord. Oh Lord, Jehovah, do something in your name, oh Lord. Do something in your name, oh Lord. Do something in your name, oh Lord. Today, Father God, do something in your name, oh Lord. Do something in your name, oh Lord. Do something in your name, oh Lord. Today, I shall not do something in your name, oh Lord. Do something in your name, oh Lord. Do something in your name, oh Lord. Today, I cannot do without you. Oh, I cannot do without you, Lord. I cannot do without you, Jehovah, Holy Spirit, I cannot do without you, I cannot do without you, I cannot do without you, oh Lord, do something in the morning. Do something in the morning. On the Sunday, the morning. Today, do something in the morning. Do something in the morning. Do something in the morning. Today, everlasting Father, do something in the morning. Oh, do something new, name of Lord. Do something new, name of Lord. Today. Amen. 
our Lord, our Savior, our healer will do something new in your life today. My beloved sisters, brothers, mommies, daddies that are sick right now in the hospital at home. Lord Jesus, we do something good to you today. He will do something new in your life today. That sickness will not stay in that body because your body is the temple of the Holy Ghost. Your body is the temple of the Holy Ghost. That sickness cannot dwell there. Never. No, 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 no. It has to. It has to by the power of my Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Before we pray for you, please. I want to ask you, do you have anybody that have hurt you that at any time you remember that person, at any time you remember that hurt, it grieves you so much, you cry, you know. You go to your crosses, you cried. Maybe you are with your friend, you are just talking right now, the enemy that caused that person to hurt you will remind you what that person has done to you. You will go to the toilet, you will cry. You wipe your face, you come and say with your friend again. Please, I want you to have, have a place in your mind, in your heart to forgive that person. Lord Jesus wants to hear you. Please, don't hold unforgiveness towards that person. Please. I know if I'm telling you that it is not hurt when somebody hurts you. Mostly the one that close to you. It hurts. Please forgive. I want you to forgive that person. Please release that person from your mind. Release that person from your heart. Don't keep that person in prison in your heart. Because many sicknesses can, many sicknesses comes from uh, from bitterness, from grief. What somebody has done to you, now your heart is bitter. You are bitter. Your heart is shattered. They have wounded you. They have wounded you by their words. Saying what is not true about you. Or oh, they have molested you as a child. Please, I want you to forgive that person. They have cheated you. They have given you name. Please forgive them. It's not worth for you lying down there. Sick. Because when you remember them, somebody mentioned their name in your presence that day, that day is not a good day for you anymore. That person that mentioned that person that hurt you has spoiled your day that day. You are bitter. You are grieved. Please, forgiveness is for everyone. Forgiveness is for, billion, for the believers. Forgiveness is for unbelievers. Please release them from your heart. Release them. God wants you to be well. God wants to hear you. As what God said in his word, if you don't forgive, he will not forgive you. Don't let unforgiveness eh, stay this silly from you. Don't let it say this. It, it's not worth for you lying down there. Maybe the person is not alive anymore. That hurt you. That wound your heart. Maybe that person is not alive anymore. Maybe that person is still alive. Forgive. Forgive that person. God wants to hear you. Please forgive. You know, you and I, we have sinned against somebody. We have hurt somebody one way and another. Please let us forgive. Have mercy. Show that person mercy. Show that person mercy and God will show you mercy as well. Forgive that person. Please, don't say, I will never forgive that person. Even though I die, I will never forgive that person. Let me tell you. My sisters, my brothers, my mommy, my daddies. If you say, you will never forgive that person because they, I know they have hurt you. You say you will never forgive them. 
Even though you are you you are not alive anymore, you, till you die, you will never forget it. Please don't do so. Is there enemy that don't want your soul to live in, with your father in heaven? If you can hold on forgiveness towards somebody that hurt you, you don't want to release that person. As Father God said, he will not forgive you as well. That means when you close your eyes there, you will not see God. God doesn't want that one for you. He doesn't want you when you close your eyes. You suffer here on this earth. When you close your eyes in death, you will see you don't spend eternity with him. He doesn't want that one for you. He doesn't want you to spend your eternity in hell for you. Please forgive that person. He loves you so much. He wants to hear you. He wants you to enjoy the life that he has blessed you with. Because when you are sick, are you enjoying the life? You have the money. Because of sickness, you cannot you, you, you are not enjoying the money you have. Your family, you have the you are not enjoying because of the sickness. You are crying. They're lying down there. Please let it go. Release those person, release those people from your mind. They are not worth for you. Lying there, sick, not having a good life. Please forgive. God wants to hear you. You will stand up and testify. What you couldn't do for before, you will do it by the grace of God Almighty. And your healing, in the name of Jesus Christ, your healing shall remain in Jesus' name. Amen. Please forgive. Please have room in your heart to forgive. Please forgive them. Please forgive. Jesus loves you. He loves you so dearly. Please forgive. He will forgive you. The moment you forgive, say, Father God, I have forgiven. Father God, Please forgive me for my holding on unforgiveness for, to damn person. Measure the person's name. God knows everything and forgive that person. You never know that person that you, you release right now from your heart. And that little prayer that you pray, God heard you. You never know God will go and talk to that person. Maybe it's your prayer. That we even bring that person to the to the, to God. Maybe it's your prayer that we save that one, that, that person so that we beg that person to come to Jesus. You never know. Maybe that person is crying in secret. Why did I do this evil to you? But they don't have the God, they don't have the, the, the boldness to come and tell you, please have mercy upon me. I have hurt you dearly. Please forgive me. Please have mercy. On them. All of us, we have been hurt in one way and another. Please forgive. Lord Jesus loves you. Lord Jesus loves you. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Thank you for forgiving them. Thank you for releasing them from your heart. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. Our God is good. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah.
Master Jesus, hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Now we pray for you. Please receive your healing in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Let us pray. <laughs> oh, Heavenly Father, the King of kings, the Lord of all the Asians of this. Father God, Father, as you have sent me to go and pray for your sons, for your daughters. Father, I'm doing what you have sent me right now, Father. Father, you said according to your word, I should lay my hand, I should lay my hand on the sick, they shall be healed, they shall be healed. But I stretch my hands out right now to that my sisters, that my brother, that my mommy, that my daddy in the hospital at home that's sick right now. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Father, arise in your power and heal your children. But I let your healing rain right now, mighty God, shower upon your sons, your daughter, Father. But I let your mighty hand rest upon them, your mighty hand of healing rest upon them in the name of Jesus Christ, my Father, my Lord. Father, your body, your children's body is your temple, Almighty God. Sickness and disease cannot do it in there. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, my Father, my Lord, my Savior, my Redeemer, you are giving the keys of kingdom. Oh, Lord, my Father, my Lord, you said, whatsoever I born on this earth shall be born in the heaven. Whatsoever I lose on this earth shall be lost in the heaven. Father God, I take authority over those foul spirits. I take authority over every foul spirit, every sickness and diseases. Every spirit of infirmity that is disturbing the children of God, I command you right now in the name of Jesus Christ, lose your hold. I command you in the name of Jesus Christ, you that demons of sickness and sin, I command you to lose your home. Get out of the children of God's life right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I command you to live right now. This body belongs to Jesus. You cannot do it in there in the name of Jesus Christ. I bind you and I cast you. I bind you and I cast you out one way to the pit in the name of Jesus Christ. I bind you in the name of Jesus Christ. You false spirit, I bind you. You sickness and disease, I bind you. You demons of sickness and sin, I bind you in the name of Jesus Christ. I cast you out. I bind you and I cast you out. I bind you and I cast you out. I bind to the happy right now remain bound in the name of Jesus Christ in the day of ju the judgment day of the Lord in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ speak healing unto that, unto that son unto the daughters of God I speak healing in the name of Jesus Christ the children of God receive your healing in the name of Jesus Christ wherever you have right now receive your healing stretch your faith out in the name of stretch your hand of faith out and receive your healing Re healing rain is showering right now washing you right now cleansing you from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet receive your healing in the name of Jesus Christ. don't doubt don't doubt receive your healing in the name of Jesus stand up and do what you couldn't do before in the name of Jesus Christ our Lord is a healer. Hallelujah. He that he two thousand years ago is still healing. Father God, arise and destroy every powers of darkness out of your children's life in the name of Jesus. Any demon that want to resist, every demon of sickness has, that want to resist not to live in your children right now, Father, let your thunder fire arise and scatter them in pieces. Let them be roast to ashes in the name of Jesus Christ, my Father. Father, mighty God, heal your children in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, you are the healer. Father, speak in the name of Jesus Christ. Speak healing unto them right now. From the crown of their head to the sole of their feet, I speak healing unto their blood, I speak healing unto their organs, I speak healing unto their tissues, I speak healing unto their bones, I speak healing unto their organs, I speak healing unto their, 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 their kidneys, I speak healing. 
unto the intestines. I see healing unto them from the crown of their head to the sword of the feet. I said, receive healing in the name of Jesus. Christ. sons and daughters of God, wherever you are. Receive your healing in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing. I speak healing unto you. In the name of Jesus Christ, you are healed from the crown of your head to the sword of your feet. By the sweet and strengthened by the stress of Jesus, we are here. You are healed in the name of Jesus Christ. All the glory belongs to you, God Almighty. Father, that Almighty God, I thank you for your healing, your sons, your daughter, right now. Father, their healing shall remain in the name of Jesus Christ, my Father, all powers belong to you, Lord. Father, any power, any spirit, any personality want that want to attack me spiritually, physically because of this prayer. Father, let your fire, let your burning coals of fire fall upon their head in the name of Jesus. Let your burning coals of fire fall upon their head. There is no peace for the wicked. Let them be tormented do it, they are not. No peace for them in the name of Jesus Christ. You said according to your word. Turn no man, not a child. Do my prophet no harm. Ha, hallelujah to the Lamb of God. The rod of the wicked shall not rest upon the righteous. It is written, I am completing my Lord Jesus Christ, which is the head of all place, equality, and power. I know who I call upon. Jesus Christ is my Lord, my Savior, my Redeemer. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I thank you. Father, I thank you for your healing, your sons, your daughter. I thank you for this healing, Lord. That day, this healing shall remain in your children's life. Father, I see their healing with your precious blood of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. I am happy for you. I am happy for you. Rejoice and enjoy your healing and testify. Go out there, testify like Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ sent uh, send our daughter to come and pray for me. And I am here. Testify. Go and testify. Go to your church. Go to your neighbor. Just testify in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord for healing you. We bless the name of the Lord because you are a child of the Most High God. Your body is a temple of the Holy Ghost. Sickness and disease cannot stay there. Foul spirit cannot stay there. The spirit of infirmity cannot stay where Jesus Christ dwells. No, 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 no. No. In Jesus' name, amen. You are healing. In Jesus' name, I'm happy for you. I'm happy for your healing. In Jesus' name, amen. Please, if you're out there that you don't, you haven't accepted, Jesus Christ, he has shown you his goodness. You haven't received him as your Lord, as your, as your, as your Savior. You haven't accepted him as your Lord, your Savior. Please, I want you to do so. Lovely Jesus that came to you right now, he, you will see the same Jesus that will save your soul. He's our savior because he's coming back. Let me sing this song for you. He's coming back again, my Lord is coming back again. He's coming back again, my Lord is coming back again. Oh, he's coming back again, my Lord is coming back again. Glory. Hallelujah, he's coming back again. Oh, he's coming back again. My Lord is coming back again. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, he's coming back again. My Lord is coming back again. He's coming back again. My Lord is coming back again. Oh, glory. Hallelujah, he's coming back again. Our Lord Jesus Christ is coming back again. He came before. He was born and he died for us. He went back, he rose up again and he, he rose up on the third day. Now he went back to heaven. He promised all his sons, all his daughters, he's coming back to take us and he's coming back again. Please, he wants you to be one of his child. When he comes to take his children, he wants you to be there. <coughs> Excuse me. He doesn't want you to, to be left behind. He doesn't want you to be left behind that you will, that day you say, oh, how do I know? No, 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 that will not be your portion. That will not be my portion in the name of Jesus Christ. Please give your life to Jesus. He loves you so much. He doesn't want you, when you finish on this earth, not spend eternity with him. He wants you to spend eternity with him. There is heaven, there is hell fire. There is eternity, two eternity. He wants you to choose heaven eternity. Because he's the one that sent you to, from heaven to here, but it's your choice for now. I thank God he gave, he gave us our way to choose. But he wants you and I to choose him. Because he's the good God. Because self for you is not a place for you and I to spend our eternity. Eternity is the balancing, no ending. 
He wants you when you finish enjoying yourself on this earth to come and enjoy final enjoyment, everlasting. Joy, joy, joy in heaven. There is no sorrow. But in hell for your sorrow, not, no, no, no water, no food, only torment, only sorrow. It's terrible because God didn't create his children to go there. He created hellfire for Satan and the demon, the fallen angels. But because of the disobedience of some of the children of God that is in the hellfire right now, because of the disobedience, they went there. They heard about Jesus. They didn't give their life to Jesus. They said, I don't believe it. This Jesus is the son of God. Jesus Christ is the way, the truth, and the life. There is no other God can get you to heaven, no. Because he's the one that paid the price for you, greater price. High price he paid for you and I, so that you and I, when we finish on this, we will come and meet him. Because our first, our first father, our first father, then our, sorry, our first parents, our first parents, they fell. They fell, Adam and Eve, they fell. It's because of that, since that time, since start raining on this earth, they hand over the, 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 the glory that belongs to, to us, they hand over it to Satan. But I thank God for Jesus came and gave us that glory back. Jesus came and paid the great price for it, so you and I, when we finish, we can come and spend our eternity with, with, with him. He has prepared, he has prepared right now. He has prepared a mansion waiting for you. All he wants you to do, just accept him. Tell him to come and be your Lord, your Savior, your Redeemer. On that day, you will see him, you know? Huh? You know, just imagine, just think about it right now. Just picture it out. On that day, you see Father God, eh? Father God that created the heaven, that created the earth, that created everything. The whole universe. That day you will see him too. face to face. Not just hearing about God. You will see him. Safe. So you will speak. You will speak to him face to face. Not just only so, some minutes, some from everlasting to everlasting. You are with your Father, Almighty God. What a joy! What a joy! The one that is in the hellfire right now, they never see God. They heard the voice of the Almighty God say, "Depart from me." That is it. They have. They not seeing God. What a lost. What a great loss. That will not be your portion, my, 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 my sisters, my mommy, my daddies, my brother. That will not be your portion. Your portion, when we finish on this earth, we will see our maker. We will spend our eternity with him. We will live with him. We will enjoy with him. We will enjoy the mansion that he pr promised us. What a joy day that day will be for you and I. Accepting him as your Lord, your Savior. On that day, that wedding day of our Lord Jesus Christ, you, all of us will be there. We fly in white garments. And with crown, glory, the crown of glory, with diamonds, please, it's worth for you and I to be hungry to, to spend eternity with, with our Lord Jesus Christ. We should not just see the, the, uh, this only this earth, where we are going, where we are going to spend eternity. Let us think of, about it, please. I want you to give your life to Jesus. You will enjoy him too much. You will enjoy him here. After finishing here, you will go and enjoy him from everlasting to everlasting. Please, he's knocking. He's standing at the, at the door of your heart right now knocking. All you have to do, open for him. Open for him and tell him, Papa Jesus, come and have your way. Papa Jesus, I give you my life. Papa Jesus, use me for your glory. Hallelujah. He's there. Oh, he's just waiting for you to just say it. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Please, I want you to accept him today. Don't let this, don't let, don't, don't, don't proscane. Don't say tomorrow, next tomorrow. No, 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 no. Today, the salvation has come to your domain right now, comes to you right now. Please accept him. Because you and I, we don't know the day, Father God, we call us. You know, we don't know. There's many people, there's people that went to bed last night. You and I, we went to bed last night. God woke us up. But some people went to bed last night. They didn't wake up this morning. Some didn't even seek, you know. Some didn't even seek that went that didn't wake up, you know. You and I, we are so privileged that He woke you and I up. He have you, He have you in mind. Please accept Him as your Lord, your Savior. Please don't turn this off away. Jesus Christ loves you. Jesus Christ loves you. Give give Him your life. Give Him your heart. Tell Him to come and be your Lord and your Savior. Mean it from your whole heart. Savior wants to save you. He's our Savior. He wants to save you. He wants to rescue you. 
from the way of destruction. Please give him your own heart. As I as we pray the salvation prayer, as I've already said, please, there is no other way you can get to God. There is no other way you can make heaven. It's only by Jesus. It's only by you accepting him as your Lord, your Savior. All the other gods, those small G gods that died, you heard them. They said, this one is the God of the... Do you, none of them shed their blood for you. None of them died for you. None of them rose up again for you. No, only Jesus that shared his precious blood for us and died for us and rose up on the third day. And he promised all of his children he's coming back to come and take us on again. What a day that day will be that you will see Lord Jesus Christ on the sky. You and I, we caught up to the air and go and meet him. He worth everything. He worth everything. Please give your life to Jesus. He loves you. He loves you more than you can even imagine or think of. Please give him your life. Give him your life, please. He loves you. He loves you too, GLA. Please give him your life. Please, he doesn't want you to cry hard. Down. He doesn't want you to miss him, that you will not see him from everlasting to everlasting. No, that is not your portion. That is not our portion. Please give him your, he loves you so much. Please. As I will pray the salvation prayer, mean it from your whole heart, from your whole heart. Please. It will do you good on this earth. After living this earth, it will do you good from everlasting to everlasting. It will do you good in Jesus. It will do all of us good. Amen. What a day that day. All of us will meet each other in heaven. What a day. Please pray this prayer after me in Jesus name. Amen. Dear God, Dear God, I am a sinner. I need forgiveness. I believe that Jesus Christ shared his precious blood for me and that died for my sin. I am willing to turn from sin. I now invited Jesus Christ to come into my heart as my personal savior. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you for accepting Jesus Christ as your Lord, as your Savior. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. We bless the name of the Lord. Our God is good. Our God is good. Thank God for your life. I welcome you in the body of Christ. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. Please buy Holy Bible and be reading the word of the Lord. Please, when you are reading the Bible, you are reading the Holy Bible. Anyone to do you don't understand, please don't turn the, don't drop it and say that I don't understand. I don't know. We are growing in grace. I thank the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit of God is with you right now. He's our teacher, our leader. He's our comforter. He will continue teaching you, teaching all of us. We are growing in grace. We bless the name of the Lord in Jesus' name. Amen. Please look for a Bible church. The church that teach on the Luther word of God. I pray God will lead you to that church in the name of Jesus. And they will teach you exactly what you need to live a holy life, righteous life. They will teach you by the grace of God in Jesus. Name. May the Lord bless you. Remain blessed in the name of Jesus Christ. The angels of the Lord, they are rejoicing over you right now, over yourself. They are happy. They are rejoicing, dancing, jubilating right now because you have given your life to Jesus. And I am happy for you. I welcome you. In the body of Christ, in Jesus' name, amen. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you, in Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God, amen. Tell your pastors, please, tell your pastor that uh, you want uh, water, but you want to baptize for them to, to make water, for them to baptize you. Tell them you want water, but, uh, water baptism. You know, Lord Jesus did it. Lord Jesus that baptized, and he told us to do the same. Please tell your pastors, please, if you haven't baptized, maybe you've been a Christian, a Christian for a long time, you haven't done, uh, we haven't baptized, what have baptism? Tell your pastors, that Jesus Christ said we should baptize. Please, I want to baptize. Please, can you do it? Can you make it a day, if it's a day for me to, be, to baptize me? Is that is biblical? Please may the Lord bless all of us in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Remain blessed. If our Lord Jesus Christ is coming today, what a joy! All of us we cut out to the air and go and meet Him on the sky. Amen. Remain blessed in Jesus' name. Amen. Let your soul may the Lord bless you all. May the Lord bless.
bless you, virtuous woman. I am proud of you. Jesus Christ is proud of you, virtuous woman, in the east, in the west, in the north, in the south. All virtuous women worldwide. May the Lord bless you. Oh, may the Lord bless you. Oh, may the Lord bless you. You virtuous woman. Ah, Jesus Christ is proud of you. If you can see the heart of Jesus, if you can see the joy you people are bringing to Jesus every day, seeing you are now living the holy life, righteous life, seeing you are now obeying Jesus, seeing you are now going out there evangelizing, winning so for Jesus. Oh, what a joy, what a joy you are now bringing to Jesus' heart every day. Please, the virtuous woman, Jesus loves you. Jesus loves you. On that day, when we will see him, hallelujah, what a day that day will be for us, virtuous woman. Virtuous men worldwide, what a day that day will be for you and I, seeing our Savior, on that day all of us are with him. What a day. And you are asking for the Lord Jesus Christ question. I am asking, this son, this sister is asking, this sister is asking, this sister is asking, and he's asking at the same time. What a job. That you and I, we will stand there, we will see where our lovely Jesus. He will hold our close the rapper so he said, my daughters. You please me on this said, Oh, I will honor you. I thank God for God. He said, I will honor those who that honor me. Virtuous women, wherever you are, may the Lord bless you. God will honor you abundantly in the name of Jesus Christ. Virtuous women, wherever you are, east and the west and the north and the south. Continue winning so for Jesus. Continue winning so. Don't send, don't let somebody tell you the woman should not preach. Don't let somebody lie to you because they want to see your blessing of uh, winning souls. Don't let them see your blessing of winning souls. Win so for Jesus. He want everything. No let one so want what everything you can think of. Go out there. Let us go out there. Carry the seed of love. Be just be uh, throwing the seed of love. Jesus love you, my sister. Just be carry that. Just be throwing that seed. Jesus love you, my sister. Jesus love you, my brother. Let us be, begin to uh, evangelize Jesus. Testify Jesus to the to, to, to the dying world. Tell people Jesus look Jesus Christ love them. Tell people to come to Jesus, give their life to Jesus. He pleased our lovely Jesus. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. God will bless all of us. All the virtuous men worldwide. God will bless all of us in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. We bless the name of the Lord for choosing us. For choosing not to be one of his children, one of his daughters. We are grateful to him in Jesus' name. Amen. Remain blessed, virtuous women worldwide. Remain blessed, remain blessed, remain blessed in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Please. Please, my sisters, my brothers, my mommies, my daddies, please, if you have a ball pen with you, please, I would like you to get a piece of paper. I want to consult scripture to you. Write it down in your quiet time, your reading. I know our master Jesus, Holy Spirit, we minister to you, we speak to you in Jesus. It is my prayer. God, we give you the grace to obey his word in Jesus' name. Amen. Let me call it. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. Amen. The book of Psalms, 135 verse 15. The book of Deuteronomy 7, 25 to 26. The book of Isaiah 30, 22. The book of, the book of, hallelujah. The book of Isaiah 31, 7. The book of Deuteronomy 22, 5. The book of Jeremiah 30, sorry. The book of Jeremiah 4, 30. The book of Second uh, Kings 9.30. The book of Ezekiel 23.40. The book of Revelation 21.8. The book of Revelation 20.15. The book of First, King, First, First Corinthians 11.5-6. You can read it if you, want, if you have the time to read it from one to, to the end. The Lord Almighty will speak to you in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. Our God is good. Our God is kind. I thank God for God. Daughters of Zion, may the Lord bless you all. <laughs> Daughters of Zion, wherever you are, may the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you all the daughters of Zion. 
In the east, in the west, in the north, in the south, may the Lord bless you all. You are unique to Father Almighty God. You are precious to Jesus. We are precious to Jesus. Daughters of Zion, wherever you are, may the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. Daughters of Zion, please, I want to tell you, please, as you are now, we love Jesus. Please, let us honor our Father Almighty God. It plays in when you and I honor him. When we do what he, what he told us to do, what he said we should do in his word, please let us obey him. You know, he's answering your prayers. He's answering my prayers. Let us honor him as well by obeying him, by obedient to his word. Please don't say you love him and he's answering your prayer and you are disobeying him. He's having patience towards you and towards me for you and I to repent. Please don't say because even though I'm packing makeup on my face and putting all those uh, fake, 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 fake allergies, fake nails, you know, artificial this, artificial this, please, fake hair, false hair, false name. You see, false, 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 false is lie. False hair, false name, false eyelashes. You see, false. <laughs> the word of the Lord say Revelation chapter 21, verse 8. All liars. Because when you are doing just so you are lying. When you are uh, bleaching your skin, I say, daughter of Zion, you are a liar. Packing makeup, a lipstick, and you know, I like you. You draw the pencil up to your ears. You are a liar. Even though you call yourself daughter of Zion, please, Jesus wants to set you free. Ask him to deliver you from those demons. All those demons, you never, all those things that you are putting in your, do you know all of them have a demon attached on it? May the Lord deliver you. As he deliver me, we deliver you in the name of Jesus Christ. Don't ask us, Zion, please let us honor our Father Almighty God. He doesn't want us to miss him. He doesn't want you and I to cry and that no. Daughters of Zion. Don't say it because he's answering my prayer. If you try dress anyhow, I dress her with dresses, I dress with her open and the sadism dresses. Men are funny that it don't, it's not my business. It's your business. It better, you better know it's your business. If it is not your business, <laughs> it's your business. God doesn't want you to go where there is no return. Please. Please, let us honor our Father Almighty God. Let us dress modesty as a daughter of Zion. Daughters of Zion, let us dress modesty. When you dress, dress, dress where? Don't be dressing that a half of your breast is, is everything you can see. The, the men out there, please help our brothers as well, please. You dress uh, your, your breast and you come into church, oh. Eh? And your back of your, of your dress is up to the waist. You open it. For what? Who are you showing it to? And you're coming to the presence of your father, almighty God. And when you are going to, for interview, just interview. I said, the daughter says, when you are going to interview, you dress well. And when you are coming to the make of the whole universe, you dress anyhow. And you call yourself, you are a daughter of Zion. God loves you. He doesn't want to cast you out on that day. He doesn't want you to cry, had I know. Please dress well, dress modesty. That is it. You cannot change it. That is the standard of Jesus, remain sure. The standard of God, remain sure. Father God didn't change the standard for Jesus. His standard remain sure. He didn't change the standard for the world, the, the apostle, all those, uh, those uh, women of God. By then, that is in there, they make heaven right now, they are in the heaven. He didn't change the, the, the standard for, for them. Not you and I will come and change the standard for, no. His standard remain sure. He loves you and I. No matter what you are doing, he loves you, but he's waiting for you to change. He wants you for you to dress modestly. Stop wearing dresses. Dresses is not made for a woman. If uh, somebody, the agent of Satan, you see them as a woman, you turn their woman be, whereas they are not a woman be, they are demons. Demon incarnate. They will tell you that they are. Dresses is made, actually it's made for the, for the first place, it's made for the woman. women. They are a liar. They are, they are, they are, they are, they are anointed by Satan. 
And so that God said, you and I, we should not put on one potato man. Transist potato man. Go to the public toilet. You will see. What, they, what is the, 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 the signboard there? What is the, 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 this thing there that they are putting there? You see the, the toilet, the, what they are, the sticker they are putting there, the sticker that is in there. The women is dress. The men is trousers. Eh? The tra trousers. So now, the enemy of your soul that doesn't want you to make a heaven, he will say, ah, don't worry. It trousers is made for the woman at the first place, liar. They are a liar. Don't listen to the dress modesty. Finish, period. Dress modesty. Dress what will be. The, the, the dress that will glorify your maker, almighty God. Please. He doesn't want to cast you out on that. He doesn't want to say, depart from me, you workers of iniquity. Don't say because in sanctuary your prayer. That is not, your, that is not a, the license for you and I to get to heaven. Not because he answered your prayer or because you are prophesying or people are healed or you are doing miracles. You are asking for people are receiving their miracles that you are now when you close your eye in dead, you will go to heaven. Which heaven? Which heaven, sisters? When you are disobeying him, I thank God for the, Jesus Christ is the one that said it in his mouth. On that day, they will say, Lord, 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 I have done this for you. I have done this for you. I have done this for you. We said, depart from me. I don't know you. You walk out of iniquity. It will not be your portion, daughters of Zion. It will not be my portion. Please let us listen to Father Almighty God. Let us listen to him. You said you love him. Show him how much you love him. But you obey him to the extent. And he will reward you. He will reward you all those uh, things that you will give up on him. Those jewelries, uh, those uh, packing jewelries, you don't pack jewelries on your body anymore. You don't uh, pack a perfume on your, you don't wear high heat that when you are walking before you walk like man made. Just the bad property cannot enter heaven, no. You better know. All those property of Jesse the bridge, give them up. Those jewelries, those wig, all of them, the bleaching of your skin, stop it. Marking yourself, putting part tattoo, piercing, piercing yourself, stopping your body is a temple of the Holy Ghost, virtuous men, and uh, men, sorry, the daughters of Zion. Your body is a temple of the Holy Ghost. You are not the one that holds your body. Jesus Christ bought us with a high price. Please let us dress well. The dressing. That we please almighty God. Brothers. Wherever you are. May the Lord bless you my brother. Do you know. You are the might of God. Men are the might of God. Do you know that men are the might of God. Please don't mitigate the word. Please stop bleaching your skin as a man. And the one that bleaching their skin as a man. Please stop it. Patting tattoo on your body, piercing yourself as a man. Please stop it. Take those things out of your body. The one that tattoo you have done, ask God for mercy. Please don't go back and start packing tattoo on your body. Your body belongs to Jesus. You are the might of God, man. My brothers out there, please, they're sucking, their, they're sucking their trousers. Stop sucking trousers, please. <laughs> uh, don't, adv don't advertise Satan. You sagging your trousers, you are advertising the demon that's sagging their trousers. You are advertising demons, you don't know. Better you stop it, oh, my brother, wherever you are. Oh. Dress well. Put on your trousers, trousers well. Put it on well. And when you are wearing trousers, please don't be wearing those uh, tight uh, trousers that everything is seen. And they, please, who want to see it? Please honor your God. <laughs> I love you with the love of God. Hallelujah. Please. You are cutting your hair, funny stars. Plaiting your hair as a man. Weaving your hair as a man. Funny, con 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 cutting the uh, funny stars. Please stop it. Cut your hair nicely, neat. Dress neat. When you wear your dress, please don't be open your chest that uh, women be, you start seeing your chest, they are falling. Eh? They are lost, uh, lost in after you. It's not, totally, it's not totally women making men to be lost, lost in after the men as well. Please help our sisters out there as well. Our sisters should help our brothers out. We help each other. <laughs> with the love bless all of us in the name of Jesus Christ. With the love bless. I love you with the love of God. I want you and I to make heaven. That is it. I love you so, so much. Please. 
I love you. Don't say ah uh, this woman again, please. <laughs> Jesus love you. I want that day. <clears throat> maybe me and maybe we will be neighbor in heaven. You never know. <laughs> May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. I want you and I to make heaven. Heaven. Ah, heaven. Ah, ah, nothing will take heaven away from us in Jesus' name. Anything that will take heaven away from us, Father God, take those things away from us and destroy it out in Jesus' name. Amen. May the Lord bless you. Oh, may the Lord bless you. Oh, my sisters, my brothers, my mommies, my daddies, please. As the word of the Lord says, all liars, all liars, all liars, the same destination, they will end their life. They will find their life on that day. Small life, big life, middle life, white life, big life, yellow life, green life, ye and just named. <laughs> Don't say because I'm life small, I will go free. No. Father God said in his word, all liars, the same destination, the same place that we go. There's no separation for it. The same place that we go, small light, big light, the same place, white light, green light, middle light, the same place, so oh, lake of fire. That will not be your portion, that will not be my portion. Let us watch out. May the Lord give us the grace not to lie. May the Lord deliver us from the demons of lies. In Jesus' name, amen. Please, God don't want us to spend eternity in hell fire. Please, he loves us so much. Let us obey him. May the Lord give us the grace in Jesus' name. I said, who am I if you are, when you are in the presence of God, cover your head. Your hair is your glory, yes. Your hair is your covering, yes. But when you are in the presence of God, cover your head. Your head. Your head. Your hair is your covering. Your head. You must cover it when you are in the presence of God. That is in the word of God. Don't argue. Don't be putting wig there, attachment there. All this thing you said, this is my glory. This is my hair covering. No, you must cover your head. Your hair, that is your glory. When you are in the presence of God, cover that your glory in presence of God. Oh, no, your father. Cover that your glory. Cover that your glory in the presence of God because angels of the Lord, they are there when you are praying. Women, please don't let people lie to you. Don't let those counterfeit preachers lie to you. Don't have to cover your hair. Your hair is your, is, your, is your covering. Yes, your hair is your covering as a woman. Your hair, my hair is my covering as a woman. But when you are in the presence of God, pray, cover your head. Your head. The Bible said, cover your head. Let me read it for you. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. The book of First, First Corinthians, let us go there together, please. Let us go there, please. The book of First Corinthians. Hallelujah. 11. I read in Jesus' name. I start from a praise master Jesus. The book of First Corinthians 11, I start from 5 to 6. And there I will read 13 to 14. Listen carefully and, for, and, and uh, to 15. Listen what they were. You know, the people. <laughs> I thank God for God for giving us the grace to understand his word. Look what daddy said. It's there they are confusing people. Listen. The word of the Lord said, I read in Jesus' name. The word of the Lord says, he said, but uh, every woman that uh, prays or prophesies with uh, her hair uncovered, dishonor her head. Listen, every woman, hmm? every woman, the Bible is telling you now, every woman that, uh, that uh, prayed and uh, prophesied, leave her hair uncovered, leave her head uncovered. He said, that prays with her hair, with her hair, with her head, not with her hair, with her head uncovered, dishonor who? Dishonor her whole head. 
when you are in the presence of God, as a woman, you don't cover your head, you are dishonoring your head. Not just only dishonoring God, though. You are in the presence of God, as a woman, you don't cover your head. You prophesy, you don't cover your head. Father God said, you are dishonoring your head. Hmm. For the daddy is an even, all one as a if a she were shaven. Father, the word of the Lord said, as a woman, if you know, okay, you don't want to cover your head because you don't want to cover your head. Okay, if you don't want to cover, it says shave it. You know? You know when you shave, when you shave, how you shave? You shave that there is no hair. No, as you see it, when you shave, you know when in uh, in Africa, I don't know where you come from in Africa, they will say the guri makba. Here, with like this, no hair, no hair, no hair. So he said, if you know you cannot cover your head as a woman, because when you're in the presence of God, a praying a prophesy, you don't cover your head, you dishonor your head. And if you don't want your hair to be dishonored, then shave it, shave, shave, shave it, no hair there. We are continuing verse 6. For if the woman be not covered, let her also be shown. But if it be a chef, if it be shame for a woman to be shown or shaven, let her be covered. The word of the Lord said, if you as a woman, if you as a woman, you don't want to cover your head when you are praying, when you are prophesying, the word of the Lord says, shave your hair. So if you know it's a shameful thing for you, going out with no hair on your hair, head, you is a shameful thing, except then cover it. Cover your head. Cover your head. Cover it. Cover it. Don't dishonor your head and don't dishonor God. Praise Master Jesus. Let's go to, 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 to 13. Let's go to 13. First Corinthians 11, now 13 to 15. Look what that it says here, the word of the Lord. It says, judge in yourselves. You see? Is it comely that a woman pray unto God uncovered? Question is asking you are not here. He said, judge for yourself. You just judge. Just think about it. The word of the Lord is telling you, Anna, as a woman, you just think about it. Is it right? Is it right when your woman is in the presence of God, not covering, pray, not covering her head? Is it right? Just judge for yourself. It's what of Almighty God. The word of the Lord is telling you, Anna. Is that judge for yourself? Think about it. Is, is it right? Being in the presence of God as a woman, not covering your head. Question. Verse 14, he said, does, he said, he said, he said, he said, does not even nature itself teach you that if a man has a long hair, it is a shame unto him. If a man has a long hair, is it is a shame unto him. Verse 15. He said, but if a woman have a long hair, if a woman have a long hair, it is a glory to her. Your long hair is a glory to you as a woman. Not, not a wig, not a station. Your hair, a woman, your long hair is a glory to you. Not put, put in a, a false First hair, you said it's your glory. That is not your glory. You are lying. That is not your glory. Huh? That is not your glory. He said that for the hair, hair is a giving her for recovery. Your hair is giving for you and I for recovery. But when you and I are in the presence of God, we cover our head. We cover our head. He said, think about it. Is it right for you and us, a woman, being the presence of God, not covering our head? Think about, is it right? The word of the law asks you a question. Is it right? Think for yourself. Judge it for yourself. Your hair is your, your hair is your covering. 
But when you are in the presence of God, praying and prophesying, cover your head. He said, if you don't cover your head, when you, when you are prophesying, when you are praying, you are dishonoring your head. Guma, you are dishonoring your own head. Your own head. You are dishonoring it. When you are praying, you are, you are prophesying in the presence of God. You don't cover it. You, do, you don't cover it. You are dishonoring your head. That is it. That is it. Please, don't be deceived. Said, uh, uh, hair is my covering. Yes, your hair, my hair is our covering as a woman. When we're in the, in the presence of God, pray, we cover that. Uh, we cover our head. In Jesus' name, amen. May the Lord bless us. May the Lord give us the, the grace to understand his word. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name, amen. We bless the name of the Lord. This is the word of the Lord today. We bless the name of the Lord. May the Lord give us the grace to, to obey him. Amen. I love you with the love of God. Amen. Father God, I thank you for today. Let your will be done. In that. I will give us the grace, O oh Lord, to honor you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I love you with the love of God. Shalom, shalom, shalom. Amen. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. Hallelujah for the logo, Domini Potent training. Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise the Lord. Oh, hallelujah.